हे गाइस वेलकम टू द डे वन ऑफ असाइनमेंट्स ऑफ फाइव डेज ऑफ गूगल एंड कैरल कोर्स सो इन दिस वन वी विल बी लर्निंग अबाउट ए डी के विच इज़ एजेंट डेवलपमेंट किट एंड इट इज़ यूज फॉर डेवलपिंग एंड डिप्लॉइंग ए आई एजेंट्स विद द हेल्प ऑफ गूगल सो दिस इज प्रोवाइड बाई गूगल गूगल ए डी के एंड दिस इज अ नोट फॉर यू गाइज दैट यू डो नॉट हैव टू सबमिट दिस देर वॉज लॉट ऑफ पीपल हुर आस्किंग If you have to submit this, no, you do not have to submit anything. No submission is required. You just have to learn and see how this works. So now click on copy and edit to make your own copy of this Kaggle notebook. And your Kaggle notebook should load. Now here, this is a little bit of uh, license and things. You don't have to read this. Just ignore it. Here is the first one. It's installing dependencies. Here, if you click run, as they have uh, said, if you get stuck. You can always click on Run and Factory Reset. As of now, we have not done anything, so there's nothing to Factory Reset. So the first one is Setup. This is pip install Google ADK. This is for those who are doing these things on their own computers. We just have to run this. To run these cells, you have to press Shift plus Enter, so that you'll be able to run. Now this is the error we will get. See attached. We have to attach the secret. Now, like I mentioned in my previous video. how to attach shake secret you can watch that video in the description it will be in the description and i will also show this how you can do in this particular video uh, right now you can see there's a queue of 172 people i will skip this video to where it works and also show how you have to link your secret key that is the gemini api key click on add ons click on secrets click on add secret and enter the label the label should be named as google api key like you can see in the uh, you can see in the code which is google api key i'll just copy it here is how you have to copy the link this is the value of the gemini api key and now you can see after we click shift plus enter it shows api key setup complete now you have to shift enter these and you will see that your code is running Now bear in mind it will take some time to run this code as, uh, as it is working on cloud so please be patient this is importing a lot of libraries so that's why it is taking a lot of time after this all the other should be pretty easy now this is the one which you have to run for kaggle notebooks if you are running this out of kaggle environment you don't have to run this one uh, just press on shift plus enter Uh, it is also mentioned if you are running this outside of kaggle you don't have to run this one code now it will show helper function defined this is a helper function if you have read about it and now this is the section 2 which is your first ai agent with adk this is telling you about ai agent uh, you can read this on your own if you want a separate video on the explanation i will also make that one as well you can read these and then uh, all you have to do is press on shift plus enter so that your code runs this is some links they have provided which you can read the documentations and links which will help you we have used the model this is gemini 2.5 flash lite which is quite a light model it should not be that hard to run it and we will run our agent here it will show runner created now this is the first query i will say we are sending to this just like any uh, query we sent to gpt or something if you have used any ai tools now you'll see what is an agent development kit from google and you can see the user has input their own question and help assistant has answered the question and after that it shows how it works you can read this if you want to I will not be explaining any things because it's already pretty late. I am uploading the video quite late, and this is your turn. You can uh, run any three of these lines or anything else if you want. Oh, actually, so uh, I will run this. What's the weather in London? This is the default command. You just have to change the uh, question in the parameter and in the double quotes. So there will uh, it is, and this is the last one. You can try the ADK web. interface to see how it works uh, make sure to check it out you have to just uh, shift enter these and then they should run and it will provide you with a link 
uh, and that link you can open and will open you uh, open a new website for you it took me quite a lot of time so if it takes you some time uh, maybe refresh the website or uh, wait for some time here you can see you have to after you run the second command you first have to first run the third one so that the web ui will work for you uh, you can read the action then just once this code runs and it shows successful uh, you can open the adk web ui which uh, is just a website for running these ai agents it will help you understand the working of ai agent a little better so this is a local host link this will not run until you are running this link on your own uh, computer which you are not so we'll have to click on this one which will redirect us to the agent development kit web interface so here it is and if you want you can ask it, it some questions and some other things here this is a gif video you can watch that as well if you want to and that is it for today's video guys if you understood then it's well and good and if you have any doubts make sure to comment i will be helping you and here i am just writing uh, a normal prompt which is write a program in python to print the sum of two numbers and it will be giving me the output pretty quick as you can see I'm offloading and there we go so this is the output from the ai agent and I hope you guys understood this assignment well and you do not have to submit it anywhere. Now coming back to the Kaggle notebook page, you go to the save version which is currently showing save version 0. You click on it, it will save a new version. You can name the version anything you want and click on save. Now it will save it uh, in a few moments. Thanks for watching guys. Happy learning.